Huawei has just announced and officially launched their brand new TrueSense system, which comes under Huawei Health. And with this new system, it starts to bring some really cool enhancements and tracking to sports health monitoring. This has been 10 years in the making for Huawei since its health monitoring begun. And this time around, Huawei says that this is its biggest upgrade to health monitoring in the last three years. And the launch of its brand new TrueSense system enhances six key features of the Huawei sports monitoring system. These are accuracy, speed, comprehensiveness, flexibility, openness, and irritative. All this will be available on devices coming in September, but at that launch event, there was a real buzz around TrueSense and what it can do for TrueSense equipped devices and Huawei Health. And in the last few months, I've really started getting into tracking some of my health metrics. So that's if I go for a run, I wanna check my blood oxygen or I wanna check my heart rate. And even when I'm asleep, I wanna track that and see how long I've been asleep for. So when the opportunity came around for me to head to China and go and have a look at Huawei's health lab where they've been developing TrueSense over the past couple of years, I was really excited and I jumped at the chance. The lab has a whole host of activities it uses to test this new TrueSense system out from table tennis, running, a 10 meter climbing wall, golf simulation, and even swimming. Huawei's health app can already track over 100 sports, and now what it's looking to do is close the gap on medical grade equipment. And when I was at the health lab, it really piqued my interest, so I gave it a go with some of these sports and tested TrueSense against some of that medical grade equipment. One of the most interesting parts of the lab for me was the high altitude simulation room. And this is one of those things that can really push the new TrueSense system. This room can simulate up to 6,000 meters in elevation and temperatures as low as minus 10 and as high as 40 degrees Celsius. What this room aims to do is test the blood oxygen monitoring within TrueSense and deliver you the results in a much quicker time than it could previously. It can now give you your blood oxygen reading 40% quicker than it could on previous devices. And that is just in 15 seconds. So it is incredibly quick. Another big use for TrueSense is intelligent monitoring of running data, where here in the lab, the golden combination of running tests is a combination of a few things. Cardiopulmonary function metabolic meter, a heart rate strap, and a professional large treadmill. But with TrueSense powered devices, you don't need all of that. The running test in the health lab is one of the activities that I tried out because I wanted to see just how accurate the TrueSense equipped device could be against a medical grade heart rate monitor. So I decided to put on my trainers and give it a go. I had the heart rate monitor strapped to me and the device equipped with TrueSense. And after a small run, you can see the results. They're incredibly close in accuracy when it comes to heart rate data. Even though I'd given it a go, I also wanted to see a professional give this a go as well, just to make sure that this was accurate and give it a few more test case scenarios. And again, the results were really close to that dedicated monitor. A focus for Huawei with the TrueSense system is its use of ultra perception sensing modules, upgraded multi-spacing optical path and cutting edge glass darkening tech. This means that when testing in the lab with something like cycling, for example, a TrueSense device can collect blood oxygen data without the need for that larger equipment that would just be impossible to wear in day-to-day -day life. At the lab, cyclists wear an oxygen mask to get accurate results on blood oxygen and respiration rate, which will deliver 100% accuracy. And a TrueSense device, while it won't have 100% accuracy, it will still exceed 98% accuracy, which is the golden standard set by medical equipment. So a TrueSense equipped device makes each workout efficient and just becomes a super smart sports companion. TrueSense can also measure more difficult activities and the researchers here at the Huawei Health Lab spent hours making sure that these results are as accurate as something like running. For example, rock climbing. This can be quite difficult to monitor, but TrueSense makes these more difficult sports a bit easier to get accurate results in. And with a TrueSense compatible device, users can select rock climbing sports mode and start recording metrics like heart rate and energy expenditure during a climb. 
Where TrueSense comes into its own here is where other wearables might lose data because of changes in things like wrist muscle strength. This can lead to uneven signal distribution and a TrueSense device won't have this problem thanks to the system's multi-spacing optical path design and cutting edge glass darkening. Because of what I just mentioned, the problem has been eradicated by a TrueSense device because the design filters out interferences and enhances the signal quality by up to 20%. Another sport that Huawei are able to test out here in the health lab is swimming. And while I'm no swimmer myself, Huawei have their own dedicated swimming professional that can help them test this. The swimming research testing area inside the lab has its own 5 meter by 2.5 meter pool. And it's also pretty deep as well at 1.6 meters. It has a paddle wheel, temperature adjustment system, and the maximum flow speed here can reach up to 1.5 meters per second. So it's a little bit like an underwater treadmill. What helps Huawei here is the fact that they're able to test real life scenarios in their own swimming pool in a controlled environment. And the underwater cameras can analyze the swimmer's kicking altitude and stroking speed. It can also measure swimming posture and stroke count. And what's exciting is, so can a TrueSense equipped device, and it can deliver you that information at speed and have really close accuracy to that professional equipment. TrueSense also brings with it refined wrist monitoring. And this is for those sports that continuously mean that your wrist is changing position when playing that sport. For certain sports that mean that wrist posture is constantly changing like rope skipping, table tennis, or golf, sometimes the PPG signal, that is the optical signal used to measure heart rate, can be interrupted. However, TrueSense now has this sensor built into its devices. And one of the ways that they can do this is that they can have a professional practice against a serving table tennis robot. I gave this a go and I was rubbish and that explains why they have professionals doing this because it's actually really hard but what makes the robot special is that it can give the exact same shot each time leading to accurate testing of true sense for Huawei when it comes to handling movement. Let's take golf as an example here as well. There's a testing area that can record various data types like swing time, downswing time, and swing rhythm. And to test the accuracy of this for their TrueSense devices, Huawei has been using over 100 golf coaches and over 30,000 swing data points to make sure that the TrueSense system can be as accurate as possible. And what Huawei's R&D team have been testing with all of these sports is their new multi-regional optical path. And this increased coverage area on these new TrueSense devices means that the signal interference is heavily reduced. And this is where the testing of golf data, rope jumping, and table tennis has been invaluable. TrueSense really does have just one aim here, and that's to make health tracking accessible, it's to make it quick, and it's to make it accurate. Huawei's wearables have received medical certification for on-risk blood pressure monitoring and ECG analysis reminders, and as well as sleep apnea screening inside of China. This means that it can deliver incredibly accurate results consistently, and you can make it part of your everyday life. That's a little bit about TrueSense, and remember those devices that are TrueSense equipped will land in September, and this is a really exciting time for people that use Huawei Health. I've been Paul for Android Authority and I will see you in the next video.